Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel and uh, if you are using Edge and even if you're not it's a good idea to go and check it out. Uh, you now have the new Edge version which is Edge 114 of course following Google Chrome 114. If you go on the upper right three horizontal dots and then you go to oh, this is interesting um, so you go to the three uh, horizontal dots, you go into help and feedback about Microsoft Edge, and uh, you will actually be updated to Edge 114, as I am going to be now on this machine. So this is the new version of Edge. It does not contain really much of front-facing features. There is something called workspaces, but that's not for most people. It's really... Uh, for people that are connected online to um, Azure uh, directories and stuff like that. So for the regular folks um, that we are, uh, there is really no front-facing feature in this new version that was released yesterday, June 2nd. So that is going to be pretty much the case here of mostly security updates because that's the thing. The new Edge version actually now has security updates that were released for Google Chrome as it is a Chromium based project. You'll be at 114.0.1823.37. I would recommend that for security reasons you update your Edge browser even if you don't use it. Sometimes you never know when a link can open in Edge even though you have configured something different. Happens quite regularly and a lot of people have mentioned this. Uh, and it, I think it's happened to me a few times. So uh, to stay safe, better update Edge also. For the rest, uh, you'll stay safe. And like I said, no real front-facing feature except workspaces for some people that are using the Azure directory. Uh, stuff like that, Mo mostly for business users. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.